Yup, what's good, original crew, man? We're back. We have how Huey and Riley got jumped by the haterocracy. <laughs> oh, man. Then look at the two. <coughs> Mm -mm. Trying to help you out. If I hit you hard, you, you, you get focused on the back end, so you get you won't even think about that no more. You know? <laughs> you see, you ain't thinking about it no more. <coughs> Stop! You're going to make my back start itching. But you see, you ain't thinking about it no more. Clear it up. <laughs> so, with that being said, before we get into it. Make sure you check out the links in the description box. Down below. You already know where to go if you want to first support. All you have to do is check out down below. Also, if you enjoyed today's visuals. Pocket it with a thumbs up. Let's go, man. Let's check it out. Let's see what's about. You ready? I'm ready. All right. So it starts off showing a car rolling up to Riley and Huey's elementary school. And that's how you know these motherfuckers got no shame. Beefing with eight-year-olds is not crazy. Excuse me, wow. We here for Huey and Riley Freeman. Bro, I thought elementary schools required you to have some sort of slip or something <laughs> before you picked one of the kids up. This is an all-white neighborhood. They saw two black people walk in and ask for the only two black kids in the school and just assumed, yeah, this gotta be their auntie and uncle. Didn't even question it. Huey Freeman with the fat-ass afro, please report to the principal's office. So Huey heads out and meets up with Riley in the hallway. They're both just confused as hell right now and know something is off. What's going on? I don't know, they said our aunt and uncle came to pick us up. Man, that shit cap. These niggas trying to do us like Biggie Smalls. Come on, let's go. The two black and white TV watchers realize that something is off because Huey and Riley still have not reported to the principal's office yet. Now they're getting impatient. We can't go too long without our carrot juice. Man, where the fuck is this classroom? The moon? Karen goes to offer them some water, but before she could even turn around to give it to them, they're gone. At this point, I already... I ain't never seen an old person move like that. Now, you know, so all people, uh, let me, they want to sit down a little bit, leg hurting, you know what I'm saying, a little winded, need a little cup of water, mouth a little dry, parts oh, or gosh. something. I ain't never, when, you ha when have you ever seen an old person move like that? I've seen old people move. Like who? Your grandma wasn't moving like that. Was she? I get more than one grandma. That grandma ain't moving like that either. She like just be in her house. She be moving. She don't be moving like that. She like to be in her house. She be out and about. No, she be. And that one time we saw her at the grocery store, she was moving a little slower than mom. Too. <laughs> That's the grocery store. I'm you. Any yeah. other time you go, we got a robot to see her. And she, she made sure she in the house. Oh, she I, had, I had a, I had a, I had a teacher. She used to, she moved pretty fast. She used to, she used to do the little, Bronze and stuff with 5K. How old was she? She wasn't that old. Uh, she she was white like or black? Seven. White or black? A white woman. She just looked old. She was actually younger than what she was. No, she was old. She was actually she was actually younger than what she looked. She was old. No, she, you thought she was seven. No, she was she actually was, fifty. She was in her like late sixties. She at was the time. At, she was no, she was or actually early mid she, sixties. She looked sixties, but she was in fifties. No, she wasn't. I promise she wasn't. I'm, I'm telling you, she I'm, was. I promise I, you. I promise she you. Was. Look up. I bet she's still alive. I think she's, she's deceased. Okay. It's up for Huey and Riley. They're beefing with hidden leaf ninjas. They stand no chance. Imagine one second you're very busy not paying attention in algebra class, and then the next second you get impressed outside by two dudes from the civil rights era. To be fair, they are literally the hateocracy, so they were probably booing that nigga MLK. Have a dream about this dick, pussy. Wow, wow, wow. It's time to teach you little Nicklets a lesson. They start busting out their tryhard poses and everything. But uh -oh. Riley not really taking them serious. What are you really about to teach us? You gonna hit us with some Neolithic ass moves while talking about some, what y'all know about this? Yo, Huey, you see these two dinosaurs? They tweaking. But look at Huey's face. He knows these aren't any regular old dudes. They ain't come here for no coupons or none like that. So he grabs Riley's arm and tries to skedaddle. But these two have higher verticals than their age and wasn't just gonna let them get away so easily. And Riley just can't believe what he's seeing. Damn, 
These two got stronger knees than D-Rose. And they split off into two different isolates. It's time to get into boxing. Riley versus Lady Esmeralda Gripe Nasty. And Huey versus Mr. George Pistofferson. These are some crazy ass names. I said that shit out loud and my couch started floating. Done casted a spell. So Huey and Mr. George are going bar for bar in the Weave Nation Olympics. Until Huey gets hit in the side with the elbow. I know for a fact he got the wind knocked out of him. Ducks the left and returns with a kick to the back into a kick to the chest. I'm crying, bro. My son getting dropped off by a nigga with loafers with no socks, a turtleneck, and a bear belly. This is sad, bro. She put this man in the spin cycle, just got to work in him. The camera- See, stop playing up here. Stop! We're watching. Why are you pinching me? I'm not pinching you. You over here playing. You are really pinching me. I'm not. See, stop. Stop, stop You're being pinching. childish right now. You are being so no, childish. Not. Because you're lying. You pinch me. Twice. Why the fuck would I pinch you? Come on, baby. Let's get back to the video. Son getting dropped off by a nigga with loafers with no socks, a turtleneck, and a bear belly. This is sad, bro. She put this man in the spin cycle, just got to work in him. The cameraman is like, This nigga is trash. And decides to just pan away. And Huey right here is treating Unk like he's the barbershop, just refuses to lay a hand on him. But Huey's also dodging all of his attacks back too. That is until he runs out of space on the bench and gets kicked away, starts rolling dumb hard while my son Get hitting up, the Peter Griffin on the ground. The Unk rolled. starts running in to finish the job, but Huey's able to roll out the way. The cameraman pans away to show the other member of the hateocracy trying to catch Grandad Lacken while he's fishing. Uh -oh. Grandad is the one who killed their leader, Stink Meaner, so now they gotta get back for gang. But Lord Rufus is old and senile so he completely misses but it don't matter because he puts his hand up he's hitting that close out on granddad and it's not looking good man so then we go back and these two are still auditioning for the weave nation president position until huey gets his arm caught throwing him and what's going on in the background is a straight murder Riley is getting absolutely baked by Gripe and hey. he gets kicked away like a soccer ball. Look at the, the spin particles flying everywhere and everything. Throughout the entire- How you getting what? worried by the woman, though? Mm -hmm. Say, how he getting worried by the woman? It's a woman. I don't care how old she is, she's still a woman. That don't mean nothing. That means something. a lot. You better whoop her ass. I showed you something the other day. What'd you show me? Not a goddamn- that video. What video? That video of the dude getting that boy by the girl. I don't condone. I don't condone violence. I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, you do. When they was in front of that store and she was dragging him. I said, damn. Uh, he, he look like a little bitch. That don't mean <laughs> That don't mean nothing, but I do not condone violence. Do not be putting your hands on a body. Oh, Riley was always acting like he bought that life for real. We done got clickbaited. Like I that, thought you, you were bad. bad. You ain't bad. You ain't <laughs> Riley's out for the count after landing a whopping zero damage, and Huey couldn't even win his 1v1, so a 2v1 is impossible, like Rod Wave jumping. So they start grilling my boys with the most menacing faces, and I'm thinking, yeah, GG's. But luckily for them, the school bell rings and all the kids come out for recess, so the hateocracy just disappears into thin air. Damn. Between Riley, Bad. Huey, and Grandad, Bounce this is straight 2018 Cavs roster type timing. Bounce One superstar and straight G-Leaguer surrounding him. There's just no way they could beat the Nigga Avengers with that squad, so they call in some help. They decide to call up Bushido Brown to come handle this for them. And look at the way he's posing, cameraman panning, sun and watch glaring. There's no, no way he came here to lose. This bout to be easy. He finna send their old ass back to their nursing home real soon. They start to surround their prey. Gotta make sure they get the angles, angles right, right, man. <laughs> so that we're jumping this nigga symmetrically and efficiently. This how you know there's some real pros at this. So Granny mm. runs in thinking she's sweet and gets her guts rearranged. He then okay. backflips out the way. And if you weren't convinced before, help. you gotta be convinced he's gonna get the job done now. This man starts emoting on them mid-fight. They really got the black Bruce Lee on their side. Unk is tired of the talking, so he tries to sneak him, but he gets summed instantly. And they say, bingo, bro, bro, you're not dominant out here no more. You're not that guy. Lord Rufus is camping in the back, so Bushido Brown... Everybody needs help. I say he don't need no help. Everybody needs help. Because everybody was kung fu fighting. They scared. And like, Bro. we done already got whooped down. No, Huey had... Now, Riley, little bitch ass. Maybe you you and Grandpa can go work on the uh, one, the woman. 
Y'all gonna have to jump on it. She, she, she the weakest link. They the weakest link. So they can go, you know what I'm saying, hopefully jump on it. He would can handle his own with a with dude. You know what I'm saying? Man, and dude could have went off with the one with the little... I feel you. I feel you. Y'all gotta help, bro. I can't come out here and get jumped by three... Yeah, I probably would. I would have helped. Niggas. I would have helped. I would have just stood there. I know that's all, Cap. Out the way, into a block, back flips out the way, and then front flips oh, into a hit. Damn, I'm getting cooked. Gotta be what the whole squad is thinking because Bushido is on timing. He then kicks Uncle Way and makes Gripe Master chuck up two air balls before hitting her with a one inch punch. Bro is real life pulling out moves from Dragon Ball Z now. Ayo, I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna need some nerd ass YouTuber to come power scale this motherfucker for me. He gotta be at least planetary by now. She gets sent flying and and <laughs> nah. Shorty got the Michael Jordan and then gets kicked away. She even got her hand out like she finna yam some shit until he pulls up and with both feet stomps the shit out of her. There's no remorse, there's no holding back. Bushido Brown heard about honoring your elders and said, I don't, I don't care. care. He was straight cooking. Give this man his chef's hat. Got the Freemans in the bleachers. You see what I'm talking about? You see, look at her. Riley, Riley, and grand, grand, granddaddy could have did that. They won't go do no. They won't go get their ass with both of them. <laughs> I told you he ain't need no help. I look like she got some fake teeth in the mouth, though. Why are you looking at this? <laughs> <laughs> do it not know the way the little squirt up around the teeth? Mm-hmm. She got some <laughs> our ops are toast. They thought they had it in the bag. Bushido ducks out the way of one uh, slash. You know what? Here go two more for y'all. But then, unfortunately, oh! the right to the dome. Luckily, that big ass afro cushioned his fall, but look at his face. He can't believe it. And look at their faces. They were mad hyped 10 seconds ago. The momentum is clearly shifting. He flips out the way of a kill shot, but gets caught lacking in the back. Oh! And they make sure to line up on both sides so there's no escaping. But Bushido Brown is locked in, blocking every single attack they throw at him. Got them both putting up no hits, straight misses. Straight Doja Cat album. Until Lord Rufus gets hit away and reverses the attack into a filthy RKO. Got bro That's on the what he's supposed to do. He don't know what the hell is going on anymore. But now that Bushido Brown is on the ground, he's caught lacking. So Lord Rufus goes in for the kill. And bro aimed way too high, getting his weapon stuck in a tree. Bushido Brown knows that now is his chance. So he charges in. But that was all part of his plan. Hitting him with the Uno reverse card, catching him coming back the other way. Come on, man. That's too easy. Yo, guys. That's why damn, I said he needed. Damn, damn. That's why I said he needed help, bro. <laughs> now, since y'all gonna sit back and watch y'all everything, you wanna help? Yes, I will have. No, you won't have. Yes, I will. You sit here saying that I won't have. I'm just gonna let my folks. Get, you, you get really whooped. got you really got your feelings off for that too. Because you be sitting up your mind like I'm, I. I do not. I do not. I tell the straight up truth. You know me no, better than I ain't that. got no reason to lie. You know me way you got better no reason than that. To lie. Yeah, you do. You got a lot of reasons to lie. What I got a reason to lie on you, you for? Like, you lie on me every day. We, I we, count. We, you sit right here and lie on me every day. <laughs> you sit right here and lie on me every day. <laughs> <laughs> what is that scene? You sit right here every day. You make up them lies on you me. Make up them, yeah, you make you up do. them lies on me. I don't make up no lies on you. I ain't getting my feelings. I was just, I ain't about to argue with this man. Yo, I ain't about to argue with you. With this man. Damn. I was about to argue with this man. Yeah. That's, that's all, all I am. Yeah, that's all I am. Right now. Just this man. I ain't about man. to argue with this man. Yep. Damn. So it's like that. It's just like that. Well, forget you two then, fool. I ain't finna argue with this woman. Yeah. Respect. Respect what? Nothing. Y'all spend most up in the comments, man. That's you got it. He needed help. Yeah. And they, in, they in the end, he definitely needed help. No, in that the beginning was, too. The beginning he had him. He, no, he used too much energy. If I if I had help, he had his head on a swivel. That's why he got. <laughs> you stupid. That's why he lost it. That's why he lost it because he, he didn't have it on a swivel. Damn. So you gonna talk shit like that about him? I'm just saying. That's he would have seen it coming if he that's, had his head on a swivel. That's trifling. Because he didn't have his head on the swivel. He lost his head. He lost it. Because he wasn't using it correctly. <laughs> that is crazy. Is that not crazy, y'all? And they shouldn't have just stood there. I wouldn't let my people go down like that. 
Like, come on now. That's one family member you want to help. It's one family member. I don't now? know who it is, but I'm I'm just saying if it was. Uh, no, nah, I'm no. Nah, it's not no. Nah. I don't care if we ain't even like on good terms. I ain't but no. Nah. Like that's cuz, but I don't, I don't I don't even know what how far down the line we cuz. <laughs> no, no. I mean, I mean, <laughs> if that's the case, then I don't call you. And now some sort of teen, I won't call you. They still yeah. family. They still blood. Y'all got some kind of. But like we won't be close. No way for me to be like. Even around, but I'm just saying, you if, if you saw somebody. you saw them getting jumped on at, at a at a game or so, you'd be like, damn, that is my 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 daddy cousin's daughter. But I don't really know. That's her my like daddy that. cousin daughter. My daddy cousin daughter. But but I don't really know her like that. But I do know we so got a kid. Damn, I wish we were closer to help. <laughs> <laughs> no, I wouldn't be like that. <laughs> No. But, man, y'all spend more stuff in the comments, man. Let us know y'all thoughts and about it do. in the comment section down below. But, as always, I do go for the name DJ with Kid This Is. We are. Yeah. Had to go and get it. Ain't no time to kick it. Got a stack of flip for my foes. Dollar, 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 dollar. Please tell me you can hear me. Don't turn your back and don't declare me. Just let me know if you need me. Dollar, 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 dollar. Let me watch out for my partners. Keep my money long. Get my team strong. Let me run away from my promise.